What's up guys, Brandon Slavinsky here. This was one of our awesome requests, Mike Posner's Do You Wanna. So, to play it, what we're gonna do, it's uh, kind of all bar chords. It's a little bit tough, but it's kind of awesome too. So, we're gonna start off with a B flat. To do that, you're gonna take your index finger on the first fret of the A string. You're gonna mute the low E string. And then you're gonna take your, I take my, I use my pinky. Some people play it like this. I play it like this. Because I'm not doing anything crazy. I'm not doing that, I'm just doing this. So, index finger, then pinky is going to go three, three, three. So, mute, one, three, three, three. And then we do an F. We're gonna do a full F. And to do that, it's going to be one, three, three, two, one, one. And then a G minor. And that's going to be, your index finger is going to be on three, and then we're going to do five, five, three, three, three. A little bit more advanced. Okay? So, the rhythm for this. Now, I know that in the song, you can also do like the upstrokes that they do. But, assuming that you're not playing with a band and you're just going to be playing this by yourself, we're going to fill it out. And of course you have to make it funky and swing it. So I'm going down, down, full. So I'm kind of focusing on that low end and high end. I'm kind of switching back and forth to get that funky feel. So, I wake up early in the morning. You go straight to sleep late at night. I kind of front like I don't want to. Inside, I'm losing my mind. And then he goes into the chorus, right? And so when he hits the chorus, it's the same chords. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna kinda hype it up a little bit. Do you want to be my baby? And then, you know that little horn part that's in there? If you wanna play it by yourself, it goes like this. And to do that, you're gonna take your index finger on the D string, third fret, and you're going to hammer on to the fifth fret of the same string, and then you're gonna drop your index finger down to the third fret on the G string. And then what I'm doing is I'm taking my ring finger back to the fifth fret and I'm just repeating that step. So that's like standard and that's with the swing on it. And you're allowed to be dirty with it, you know, so. So if we go, so. So yeah, it's a little more advanced and you know, after a while we're going to be able to get it all together. And just like that, as long as you practice that loop a couple times with me, watch the video a bunch of times and just keep on working on it. Don't forget that lead part. And you will get it. And you guys are gonna be the future rock stars of tomorrow. I will see you at the top. Peace out till next time. Hey guys, Brandon Slavinsky here. Thank you so much for joining us today. Be sure to check out our other tutorial videos. And if you have any requests, send them to requests at mahalo.com.